I don't know if I said it in the intro already because I'll have filmed it by the time this is, okay, whatever. Basically, I'm gonna be getting ready for a New Year's party. Woo! And so I'm gonna be getting ready and I'm also gonna be um, answering some questions. I'm doing it on my iPad because um, I'm filming with my phone. That's my New Year's resolution. Take YouTube seriously because I, I don't have a camera. Do you know what I mean? I've got like, <laughs> I wanna do my makeup like, um, this but it's probably not gonna end up like that also my dress is green um before i get any questions about it it's from opoly i'm gonna put it there because i don't know what it's called also i'm trying to upload this tomorrow but i'm going to a party today and it's already new year's do you know what i mean like a bit late but anyway i use this primer this is um the Too faced primer it's actually so good i should use this more I feel like i haven't sat down actually no i sat down with um india and did a video which will be going up soon it's probably already up by the time you see this because i'm a lazy little shit also i'm late are we surprised no i kind of want to go for coverage i haven't done that in a while but i feel like whenever i've got an event i always like do something different with my makeup and i'm like why don't i just stick to my usual shit but um today i feel like doing something different which is gonna be a stupid idea i know already why am i doing this to myself i don't know um I could use this NARS one. I want to be a beauty gearist. I'm going to use that. No. I'm going to take the Dior foundation and add it to the NARS one. Um, someone said, I dare you to tell your mum that you're pregnant. No, I'm not going to do that because my mum will believe me. Fun fact, I'm a virgin. I don't know why I told that. People are always asking about my virginity, so I feel like I'm obliged to tell you, but I'm really not. I'm a virgin and my mum doesn't believe me because fair enough, I have been with my boyfriend like 10 months. Um, You would think otherwise, but no, I'm still a virgin. My friend asked me the other day if I'm asexual because I haven't had sex and I just think it's kind of rude. Don't be fucking rude. <laughs> Don't be don't fucking do rude. I don't think it's a big deal. I don't think it's a big deal. Like, I want to be with this boy for a long time. So why am I rushing anything? I I feel like people are going to roast me in the comments and be like, You're a dumb bitch. Why am I... Okay, this is explicit. Um, anyway. What am I talking... Yeah, uh... Um... Oh yeah, okay. So I'm not gonna do that because my mum will believe me. My mum thinks I'm a whore. She thinks I'm a slag and I just, okay, no offense. You're not a slag if you have sex. That is your choice. I'm not saying that you're a slag. Mm, that was mean. Okay, this foundation came out really nice. I don't know if it's just like my, well, I am looking at my phone and phone just make your skin look so much better. People honestly think my skin is so good and it's just because of my phone. Like I don't have good skin. My skin has been breaking out so much recently and I know that's like ironic because I have so many skincare routines on my channel but um, I've got so- my skin has been breaking out so much. You probably can't tell, I'm gonna get so many comments like <laughs> really, You know, everyone has a different version of dare. Okay, why- I haven't- I've answered one question and that was a dare and I said no. Would you cheat on someone or get cheated on? Okay, I think that was a would you rather question. Um, I could not live with myself if someone cheated on me. No, if I cheated on someone. I would also be heartbroken and never trust anybody again if someone cheated on me. Um, okay, next question. Do any of your sisters smoke? Well, I have two sisters and they're like 12. <laughs> Are you going out or staying out staying for New Year's? Well, I'm going out. For the first time, I you know what? I don't really remember New Year's. Like, I feel like I went out one year and it was just a really random thing. I don't really go out on New Year's. In fact, I don't really go out. <laughs> okay, no, seriously, I don't go out. It's a brown one. So my mom was literally like, go out on New Year's. Because I was saying like, I don't want to go out if you're not going out. Knowing full well that I was going to go out. But, um... Okay, my foundation looks so good. I'm not being funny. Like, my foundation never looks this good. Wow. And my skin's breaking out. Wow. Best move. Best thing that happened to you, your life this year. Not to be a little pussy, but um, my boyfriend, because we started going out this year, and that has been really amazing. Are you enjoying A-level psychology? Um, I like it. It's kind of hot. You know what? I don't like it. The whole thing was a lie. Um, I do all of my schoolwork on my iPad, and I feel like that's why I like my schoolwork, because it's just satisfying to write. I'm so pale right now. Wow. I didn't know I could be this pale. Some new every day, do you know what I mean? What's your best childhood memory? 
Um, these are very like general questions. I feel like I'm on like a Vogue. 101 questions. No, but like, I keep on saying, no, but like, no. What are you excited for in 2020? I'm excited to take YouTube seriously, as I said at the beginning of the video. Loads of studio sessions booked in. Write new music, come out with new music. Um, yeah, that is what I'm excited for in 2020. Um, I want to be a, lo a lot less critical of myself. I was with um, India a couple of days ago. She was like, one thing I've noticed about you is that you're so critical of yourself. And that is so true. Like, I am so critical of myself. Like, someone could literally run me over with a bus and I'll be like, it's fine. But if I do one thing, I need to keep on going back to this picture because I'm forgetting that I need to look like that. Do you smell like fingers? Um, not particularly. I don't... I mean, fingers are on my body and I do smell like my fingers because that is me. Well, don't wash this when you're high. I guess I smell like fingers because I have fingers. Um, mind fuck. Okay, now I'm doing this NYX concealer. Um, NYX? This is e.l.f. Um, this is such a good concealer. It's really light for me. I guess I'll do it to highlight. I haven't seen these people in ages, and for some reason I want them to think I look good. I have no idea why. I was kind of sitting in my bed earlier. I'm not trying to impress anyone. I just- you know when you want to look good? Yeah. Um, I don't know why I want to look good. Like, I- well, obviously, everyone wants to look good. Maybe because I'm going to a party. Then I really just speak to myself. I don't speak to myself. I don't see how you can go get me wrong. My mum speaks to herself all the time. I'm, I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? I don't understand how you can speak to. I never speak to myself. Like, I'm actually so dumb. I just realised I film YouTube videos, which means I obviously speak to myself, which is all the time. I'm so dumb. No. Also, I never blend out stuff with a brush. I don't know why I'm doing that today. How are you so confident? I want to be like you. Um, I feel like, you know what, I'm actually, okay, I am either really confident, comfortable, or I'm really quiet. It depends. If I'm bored, or if I'm in an awkward situation, or if I'm uncomfortable, I am so quiet, but most of the time I'm loud. I'm quite, quite an expressive person, I do like to talk a lot, so I, I don't know how I'm confident. Um, I'm just like, I don't know, I kind of just say what I think. Obviously I still do, but I used to care about what people thought about me so much more than I do. My motto is everyone has an opinion, negative or positive, everyone has an opinion about everything you do. But just do what you want because everyone's gonna have an opinion on it. Whether Sally from down the road likes your videos or John doesn't or flipping Becky doesn't like it, you know, like just do what you want for yourself. I can't work out if I'm ugly. What's your dream honeymoon location? Okay, I don't think marriage is the most important thing. Like just dream location to go to. I would love to go to Japan. I think it looks sick there. I also would love to go to somewhere like the Bahamas. I'd love to go to like an island. I'm gonna put a bit of blush. This is the Cl Glossier Cream Blush. I just feel like she looks very, not natural obviously, but like she hasn't got loads of powder on, you know? You know what, I'm gonna put powder on. I don't care. Um, this is the Huda Beauty powder. It's so good. I was literally in uh, Selfridges. I was just buying this foundation basically and um, her skin looked flawless and I was like, bitch, what the f*** are you wearing on your face? It's so good. Like, you look flawless. And she was just like, I use the Too Faced um, concealer and the Huda Beauty um, powder and I love it. It literally makes your skin look flawless. Um, so yeah, I just put it a tiny bit in the middle of my eyebrows, just above. On my smile lines because I cackle like a little witch. I'm just kind of pressing that into my face. I'm not really like using that much because this is like a really light-ish look. Ow, I think I got powder in my eye. I got this for Christmas. It's a tiny little um, Too Faced bronzer. My mom's telling me to come downstairs and see what a mess I've made and I just... I'm filming. Where? What? What? and drank the chocolate milk. Oh my god. I swear on my life, I didn't drink that chocolate milk. I do so much around my house and my mum thinks that I do nothing. She actually doesn't credit me at all. I do so much here. And I'm like, <sighs> I was about to say the B word. She thinks I don't do anything. I'm like, um, honey. I'm putting a tiny bit of um, bronze on my nose. Mm -hmm. 
someone said are you going to leave anyone behind in 2019 um i don't really think it works like that if you're gonna cut someone off then just cut them off do you know what i mean like don't wait until like zero 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 like oh my god i'm gonna cut you off now there's definitely people that i have cut off but not necessarily like for the new year i have the urge to use this or this but i don't know i think i'm gonna go with this one because it's new year i haven't used it in ages it's kind of like a gloss consistency like it's very it's kind of sticky it's the kevin Aquan glass glow face i'm just gonna pat it on and i've got like blue reflex i'm gonna regret this because it's gonna mess up the makeup underneath okay that's all i'm gonna pat on okay that looks really nice actually every time i put it on it's like messed me over don't know why i put it on today if i knew that but put that a bit on my nose Um, I never really do a nude lip, but, um, I'm going to. Okay, I'm going to add some highlighter on top of that, um. And now I'm going to do my eyebrows. The girl in the pictures doesn't really have much on, so I'm just going to use this, um, Maybelline Gimme Brow, um, brow, brow, gel. put some concealer on my eyes this is the l'oreal infallible um concealer it's really light the reason i'm using this is because it has so much flashback and i just feel like for a primer on your eyes it's kind of good because i don't know you want your eyes to stand out i don't know if that really makes sense or if that even works like that but um what time is it okay i need to leave so soon okay i'm just gonna use um my Violet Voss Pro Palette. The Bestie is the crease color. Just to kind of like get started. I wanna put something down before I put like the dark color. So I'm just gonna put this Bestie color there up to my brow bone, but not at the start, just a little bit before it, if you can see. It's not too overpowering, but it's, you know, there. You see, it's not like it's at my very brow bone there, not there. Then I'm gonna go in with the color are you kidding me which is that color it's a little bit darker and i'm just going to use it in my all over my crease and i'm just gonna with a this brush doesn't have anything on it i'm just gonna blend it out and bring it up a little bit i kind of want a, a more warm toned brown so i'm going to go in with this soft glam palette from anastasia beverly hills and use the color sienna and pack it just there you know just on the outer corner crease outer crease corner does that look thing yeah, that's better it's a lot more warm than what i just used now i'm going to take this color teddy bear from the violet wash palette and i'm just going to put it kind of where i i'm going to put the black soon and kind of wing it out so that i'm practicing that shape just kind of patting it, packing it there in the outer crease. Okay, so now I've got that kind of like shape. I'm trying to make it more with on this side. Anyway, now I'm taking this noir colour, which is completely black, and I'm just gonna pack it on um just there. Kind of acting as a liner, be a very smoky one, but and then just kind of dragging it across like that. And then I'm taking a little bit and putting it on my inner corner in a lid, you know. And just because it's black, I'm really slowly just building it up so that it doesn't look too harsh or anything like that. Putting it in my inner crease, in a no, in a lid. You know, it looks kind of ashy, but it won't look ashy later and the colour above it which is mulberry and I'm just kind of using them two colours to have that warmer black if that even makes sense so that it's not ashy. Now I'm just gonna with a brush with that's got nothing on it I'm just gonna blend everything out so it's kind of more like that and I'm just taking the brush and putting it on this so it doesn't 
transfer anything. Now I'm gonna go into this palette, or this palette I have. I think it's like my first palette. It's the Urban Decay Electric Palette. This, oh my god, this used to be my favorite. So now I'm gonna just take this color, it's called Fringe, from this palette, um, and just pack it on the middle of my eyelid. Literally all the way up to the top of my lid. I'm just packing this silver colour on top of it. So I'm going to take this colour from the NYX palette. It's just this like really light turquoise colour. And just pack it on top of it. And just above. Just so it's like, you know a uh, lighter blue. I'm going to take this brush and just blend the sides a little bit. I'm going to take the colour Cypress Umber, which is this dark, cool-toned brown, and just pack that right in between the black and the brown. The black and the blue, sorry. So I still haven't got that perfect, like, blue, um, blue shimmery shade. I'm going to take the colour Revolt, which is this silver shimmery shade and just put that over. I'm just gonna try and blend all of this stuff together. Okay, so when I wet that um, that color, it was honestly a lot prettier. So. so before I add lashes, I'm gonna tight line my waterline. This just made me realize that I need to make the eyeshadow a lot darker. I'm gonna just kind of bring it out there. That liner is a tiny, tiniest bit. Yeah, by the way, this is the NARS eyeliner. Okay, now I'm gonna do basically the shadows that I did on my on the upper bit. So I'm gonna take this teddy bear color in the very inner part. Okay, someone asked, what is the worst part about being a popular teen YouTuber? Obviously because I am the same age as most of the people who watch me, it's kind of like, I don't I don't know how to describe it actually, because it's not a bad thing. It's just kind of like a weird, I don't know. It's kind of strange. I actually don't know where I'm going with this, but. So I put mascara at my bottom lashes. I don't feel like I've got enough concealer like under my eyes, like because it's such a dramatic look, I do think it should be more um, bright under the eyes. I'm gonna put some lashes on before I do um, the under eye. I'm gonna tight line my upper lash line, which I never do, but... Oh my god, I never do that. This is the Marc Jacobs mascara. I've never used it, it's my mum's, but I just... Okay, now I'm using these um, lashes. I'm gonna put the lash glue on my hand. And okay, I think I'm only gonna use like two mini lashes. The eyes are so much that they need something on the eyes. Am I okay? I feel like they need a bit of a lighter under eye. I'm just brushing it really lightly underneath. This is the best makeup that I've ever done. If you don't subscribe, I'm going to I'm using the Morphe setting, continuous setting mist. That is the look done. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you guys did for New Year's this year. Let me know if you like this look or if you want more kind of looks like it. 
and yeah i love you guys so much see you soon happy new year cheers to a new decade a new year everything yeah cool i love you guys so much and i'll see you soon with another video bye